Hey guys, welcome to Farming Simulator 19 on Riverview. So, obviously, I'm recording this video so I could have actually streamed last week. Yes, yeah, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and now we're here on next, well, last, um, yeah, Monday for you guys, but next Monday coming up for me. And I could stream on Thursday. Yeah, maintenance on the line. Uh-huh. So, we got all this sorted. Let's mem memorize now. Sweet. Uh, this trailer, I know I'll get a lot of questions about this. It is from FSUK. Seems a decent trailer, to be quite honest with you. There's some things I don't care for it. Um, some of the texture work, I feel, is DDS still, which uh, isn't the best. Now they've kind of moved away from a lot of that stuff. Uh, personal preference here, slow moving vehicle sign, I never like them. They serve a purpose. Uh, you can change up the tyres uh, for slightly taller ones, 22 and a half inch uh, rims. You can see that. But overall, it's a nice trailer, definitely uh, suits the UK style of stuff. This isn't a UK map, it's uh, not a European map, it's not an American map, it's literally a fantasy map. So you make it what you will. The trailer does have steering, but again, FSUK if you guys want that. Uh, doesn't have any auto load or anything like that you have to manually do it so we've got a load of bales now we're probably not going to do a whole lot of farming today it depends how quick we move through uh, you guys know I've been wanting to get the animals going on the map so that is what we're going to be doing today we're going to be sorting out the placement of the animals probably buying them in and all that good stuff this map is horrible to make money on I'll quite openly say that it's one of my pet pet peeves with the map uh, I think Cavalier Roy made it way too difficult. As far as just jumping in to make a bit of cash, you would need to put a lot of hours onto it. Which, uh, yeah, I don't want to do that. So, we'll be cheating in the money for the animals. And all of that good stuff and placement. Uh, chickens and the sheep. Chickens I'm probably going to go crazy with buying them, although that will take quite some time, I don't know if it'll be easy to do an XML change or what, not XML change, but edit the XML to put those in, I don't know we'll have to uh, see, because obviously it's individual clicks there's no number you can select, I wish that was the case okay, I want a 100 chickens buy 100 chickens, job done out the door you go no, you have to individually click the damn things pain in the ass, as far as sheep go we'll probably just rent a truck and semi-trailer, the Euro-style one, to do that, or just a dolly to bring those back down to the yard, and we'll be, jobs are good and as far as that goes. And we're taking the hay bales back for the sheep. I don't see us having to make any more again, I, I could be wrong on that, depends how many sheep we get. I am thinking around 100 sheep, so we'll have to wait and see, and I could always get a uh, wagon and just front mower and fill that up one time if we get too, too low. As I always say, well, not always say, but openly say, this map's a stopgap. As soon as we get anything up on the mod hub, that's halfway decent, I'll probably be moving away from the Giants ones and this. I'm not saying this is a bad map by any means. It's a it's a good map as a stopgap, but it's not up to the stuff that the style I like to play on personally. It really isn't. It's got a lot of flaws, which I, th I think uh, Cavalier Roy is working out on. But the fact you have to have a new game save for that to work properly, yeah, the map's done for me. So at that point, if I have to make a new game save, I'm not about that. I I, I get it if a map's under testing and it's not yet released to people, but as soon as a map's out. And then there's enough significant changes that you have to do a re game save redo. At that point, you've lost me. You really have. No matter who you are, you've lost me. Also, another thing, uh, at this point, you guys probably already know, but Giants have released the no collision camera. Hurrah! It works. Their own version, so we know it's not going to, theory, not going to break. We're glad to have a proper no collision camera by them back more importantly okay so we are going to be going up to the wee little grass field where you see the lime station basically is just up there is where I'm planning on putting 
the sheep and chickens if we have enough room. That vehicle uh, enhancement mod, I hope he dials in the smoke because um, it shouldn't be blue. I wonder if he actually knows that. <laughs> May have to do a uh, let him know on that. And this is going to be fun climbing up here. Oh no, not too bad. So we've got plenty, plenty of space for a shed and all of that good stuff. So, let's see how much that stuff is going to cost, because it's going to cost a small fortune. Uh, so that can have 400, that can have 100, so actually... I don't think I'll go much bigger than a hundred. So if I do, I'll let my words will uh, will have to up it. But I think for uh, I think that will be enough. So that is that. A uh, large pig, sheep pasture can take eighty. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna have to twenty thousand and a hundred and eighty. 25 is easy to remember, but I'll uh, go G S. Oh, no, I have to backspace. G S capital C tab, and then 20 foul. Backspace that, 180. And that should give us enough for. The pens and whatnot. So let's get them placed. Now I don't think I'll go back on what I said, so I don't plan on putting any more animals in this map. Yeah. That looks okay there. If it has a slight slope. That is fine by me. I'm not gonna dink around with all of that too much. Uh, so we want the that one. Ooh, had a. Scratch that needed to be itched. Uh, where shall we put it? Can't go right there, obviously. And what trough is that? Is that the feed trough or the water trough? If that's water, we'll put that in the shade, I think, actually. That can go over here. And what we'll do is we'll run that down here as far as we can. Can't be placed there. Okay. Can be placed there. Done deal. <laughs> Simple. And let's have a look at a small shed so we can throw bales down. Or shall I even bother? Should I go to the length of placing a shed? I mean, I could to be legit. Can we put one over here? No. Over here, it is. Job done. Yep, that works. Alright, let's have a look at our masterpieces. Alright, we've got a little step up there. Uh, here's pretty smooth. Here was actually spot on. I was actually worried that this would be more of a slope. I really just like the ramps that you get from some of the... Mainly the storage buildings more than anything, because look at that. That's irritating, and of course you've got a nice one for here. Uh, so I presume the pallets will go there. Uh, there's 
No more grass feed, and there's troughs. Sweet! For the time being, this can get shoved up here. Whoa, how steep is that actually? Holy crap! Okay. That doesn't look steep with the grass there, but god dang! Wow! And it didn't look like it would have placed the doom. Anyway, it's just going to be for the bales probably this side more than anything. Okay, uh, chickens. Brown. Oh, right. We'll buy one rooster. Does it say anywhere how many we're actually buying? I have no idea. I'm just going to keep clicking. Don't mind. I can, is there a quicker way of doing this? Yes, there is. It's like damn Morse code, this. Capacity reached! Sweet. Okay. Uh, how much is that? That's not bad, actually. Confirm. Yes. Aha. Rooster. Enjoy. Okay, so if we go over here, I do not think we have any water stuffs or anything. So we'll need to go grab a water tank. And we'll do that in this thing. We'll keep the row crops on it, but it's fast. So we can go and get there relatively quick. So hope you guys had a good weekend. I have no idea about mine yet. I have no idea what we did. But no doubt it will be good, hopefully. Hopefully you guys had a good weekend. Mods going up on the motto. We got a few on. Uh, fr That's today. Today Friday. Yeah, today's Friday. On Friday. Nothing crazy. Now, I'm seeing the comments time, time again about Marwa. And again, I should have addressed this a lot further on, but it's something that I'm going to be addressing quite often, just so you guys hear. I know I'm getting a lot of new subscribers of late, and. My mind's blown, I don't know where they're coming from, if they're coming from that map first look, which I guess they must be, which means if that is the case, I must have done a good job. That's awesome. Uh, but as far as content goes on the map, I won't be doing anything for a while, and that is of the request of Oxygen David and myself. We don't want to ram it down your guys' throats when it's probably going to be a while before you guys see it, and we both, both me and Oxygen David agree it's probably going to fail first time around. There's going to be something in there, whether it's for consoles, whether it's for PC, who knows, because there's no way for those guys to test on console yet. There should be. They said there was going to be in the new Giant Editor, but there isn't, as far as I'm aware, from what Oxy's told me in the past. So, it probably will fail on something. No doubt uh, it will be more than likely what maps fail on, nine times out of ten, when it's technical stuff, it's stuff to do with consoles. And that's not a hit of consoles, it's just the fact that those guys cannot test on console. The map makers, Oxygen David, any of them, they cannot test on console yet. Hopefully Giants sort that out, because it's something that really needs sorting out. It's brutal, they can't. It saves a lot of the back and forth. And that being said, there's probably other maps in testing as well, so hopefully, fingers crossed. There is, but it is first come first serve, as far as that goes. And Giants aren't stupid, I know some people may think they are, but they're not. They understand people are wanting new maps at this point, surely. I mean, Lars, the community manager, he's a good guy. He's good at his job. With the companies he's worked with, he is good at his job. So he'll probably be in tune with the community, as far as that goes. Oh yeah, we're going to want four-wheel driving for this.
Are you kidding me? Come on, go this looks look. That's cool to see the the forward drive and all that stuff are actually working. He is uh coming along with this mod for sure. It really is. Alright, give the water to the chickens, they'll probably drink all of this. I don't think we have a better water source to be quite honest. So I may have to look again the place of a water tank, it may be easier. Just on this map at least, I don't think there's a slipway going into the waterways there. And then all the chickens we need is grain. And they're sorted. They are good. Whoa! They are good to go. So do they need water? They don't need water, do they? The chickens just need grain. That's right, too. I forget. Uh, do I have anything up here that's capable? Yeah, I do, but I'll be stupid if I use that. We'll let the case. Oh, the case. Wow, the fent continue to sleep. Ah, that's got to drop off there too, dang. And... Trilla. We'll just use the dolly. I don't think it's going to require a lot of grain. Hopefully not. But never say never, and hopefully we've got some grain. Uh, weed or barley, I believe you can use. Definitely weep. But I would imagine I've got some. I don't usually empty out the whole entire silo. Yep. Now we use weep. We'll fill it all the way up just in case. I don't think in a million years it will use a full 10,000 litres of grain. But you never know. You never know. And hopefully this will make us uh, quite a bit of money, actually. On here. Yeah, I may have to come in with the train brush and uh, raise the ground up to the walls that level, because that is ridiculous. I do not like that one bit. And what side? Right side. There we go. I'm just gonna take half. Mm, yeah, about half. Well, I'm actually kind of tempted to leave this up here because I've got a feeling I'll be fast timing again at some point. So, alrighty, of course, cool. saving, saving, saving. Animals, yeah, water. That's it. Okay, oh, water, wheat, wheat. They just needed wheat. I would, what we'll do is we'll shove this here. We'll leave it attached to the tractor because otherwise I will forget this and lose it. Uh, bales there. Okay, next will be sheep. So what we will do for the sheep? We're moving quite quickly along on here. Like I said, today's video I don't feel there's going to be a lot of farming particularly. Okay, so 
This will change up the colours. Uh, what colour is that trailer? And the reason I'm going to do this is because I'll probably end up using it for the thumbnail. Uh, animals, no, the animal transport, won't it? Animal transport, this trailer here. That's right. Some colour is kind of white. Well, silvery and red. Of course, you can change the room colour if you really wanted, but. Uh, we'll just leave that as is, actually, a matter of fact, so we can get it proper. We'll go here. Uh, so to rent it, again, I'm just, like I said, I'm not going to hold back on this, I'm cheating it, all of it in. 44.2. Ow, ah, that was my hand coming off the desk. Lease. Yep. Get rid of that so I can actually see what I'm doing. Uh, trucks. Matt the man one, and... Oh, the red decisions. Bent. Massey. I think that's Massey. Oh, what was that one? Yes, Case. Hardy, kind of a darker. Yeah, we'll get Massey. Bright, fluorescent red almost. And... White rims. We go road, uh, lizard, trollbergs. I don't know why it's got that there. This is a four-wheel drive truck. Or tractor unit, at least. Why you would put road tires on it is behind me. It is absolutely beyond me. You wouldn't. You just straight up wouldn't. There's a transfer case, if you guys don't believe me. And yes, they do actually make these. Yes, they do make them with the PTO. If you look on YouTube, there are videos of this thing running around with a baler on the arse end of it. You gotta think. It's a 500 horsepower engine, four wheel drive. As long as it's dry, which if you're bailing, it should be dry. Yeah, it can bail. <laughs> and one of these days I'll have to do that with this. Just feel the pure uh, poops and giggles. All right, we'll lease this. Uh, that's gonna be, I'll just so I'm not fully cheating all the way. We'll actually lease this. All right, there you go. Here it is. Uh, we'll blip it into a drive. Start her up. I don't think I've actually really looked at this thing since it been brought back into the game. Ah, that's new. The cup. I don't know if this is a brand new truck or whether they've just gone over it pretty heavily. I feel they've just gone over it heavily, if you ask me. Sounds different, actually. Big time sounds different. Oh yeah, and just to show you guys, we've got a bailer here, so it's kind of going to be rude not to do this. There you go. We'll lower it down. Yep. Yep. <laughs> I gotta do that, because I know it's going to trigger some people at some point. I know it will. I gotta do it. It's actually a nice truck. I never really used to like the man, but this is kind of a nice truck. Although I feel the kingpin for this trailer is way too far back. Surely it would be up front a bit more. Kind of. I haven't got a cursor to say, but... Basically, if you guys can see the center uh, cross thing, I would have thought the kingpin would be around here. Not all the way back there. I don't know. Alright, where is the animal uh, place in the first place on here? Uh, down here. Actually, let's load up this so we can actually see what we're doing. So yeah, uh, right turn out of here, left, wind, 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 past our grass field, all the way over here.
Is he gonna hit? No, it's not gonna hit. Well, Das is surprising. This way, this map, you can get lost on so damn easily. You really can. What time is it? Yeah, 12.57. Not too bad. Motoring along. So, obviously I'll be streaming Friday today as well, so I don't know how far we'll get. We'll probably be just doing that field work at this point after. I think we just need to spray stuff down, fast forward time, yada yada yada. I'm ready for a new map. And the reason I say that is because I'm getting... I don't want to get bored of playing this and streaming it all the time. And Dave was saying last night he's tempted to stream a Giants map and see how it does. And I got to admit I agree! I have been half tempted. I actually loaded up Forza earlier today too and went through it and got all the cars from the car packs that have not been on. Since Fortune Island came out I played that a little bit but I haven't touched it. I really haven't. Not bored of the game. It's not like I don't enjoy the game. It's just I'm like that with Forza. I'll play the snot out of it for a hell of a long time. And then I'll drop it for a while. But I always go back to it. And the fact I loaded it up today I didn't get into a race because I didn't want to be stuck doing that while knowing full down well I needed to record. This truck is snappy, dang. This is not how I remember it. Alrighty, we don't want a pig. We want sheep. And we'll go uh, black and white. Actually, is it? What's common? I forget. I think it's white, isn't it? It's the most common. I'm pretty sure it is white. Right, I'm actually going to go to the extreme here, and a few of you are going to laugh. But I'm going to go in and put in UK sheep on my phone. And see what is the common. White faces, there you go. And some of you are probably will be laughing. Honestly, the area I grew up in the UK very rarely had any sheep around there. Very, very rarely. Trailer is full! 36... Confirm. Oh, it actually works as two layers now, does it? I don't think it ever used to. That's cool. Oh, we didn't extend it too, did we? Or did it do it automatically? There you go, ladies. I said ladies. Kind of sounded like laddies. Maybe it was laddies. Let's be honest, they're probably female. You can buy a rooster, but you can't buy a ram, and you can't buy bulls in the game. That is animal discrimination. That really is. So as you guys can see, we've got a few bales to pick back up. Nothing crazy. That needs to get transported back down to the yard, to be honest. How many sheep have we got? It doesn't actually tell us. Alright, we're at 21 ton. I want to see if we offload the sheep, if they actually count as any weight. I've got a feeling they won't. I will keep this, because we'll probably have to do a couple of loads with this. I imagine we may have 40, 50 sheep in there, if that... Is what I am thunking. Hey. Drive by that there. Won't be many sheep left.
over the hill and far, far away. And to be honest, once we get down to the yard, this is probably where we'll call it quits because we are getting close to the usual time of the video, so makes sense to call it quits there. Most certainly does. Nice trailer, this. I thought. Hedgerow. I've always liked it. I'm glad they've got an American style trailer in as well now. The uh, American stuff. Although it's probably very, very, very rare you'll ever see me use it. Because unfortunately, for whatever reason. American maps do not go well with the European community. I don't get it personally. I really don't get it. Because some of the American maps are absolutely damn beautiful. Lone Oak was one of them. Admittedly, it's a map that we'll probably never see again. Come to Farming Simulator, but... It was a beautiful map, and I don't think the community gave it enough credit. Or uh, enough time of day, to be quite honest. Uh, no, that's not where I wanted to go. It is easy to forget what way I need to go at times. I can't believe how snappy this truck is. Surprising. Most definitely surprising. Alright, where's the drop off point? Uh, it's not there, it's up here. Oh, yeah, they would have fallen over with that. Not in a million years you'd get away with that. Not whatsoever. Alright, there we go. And just so this can moonlight in the background somewhere. In the foreground. So I'll probably go for a fairly high shot. Alright, so we need to go G S T Tab 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 Tab. Enter Switch off that. Oh, I forgot we have the chainsaw on here. I'll go the mouse carefully. Print screen. That worked. Drop down. There we go. And switch on the HUD. Switch on the HUD. Enter. Or do I actually have to go for all of them? So we're at 21,000. Just remember that. Farm. And confirm. It's empty. Still a 21 up. Didn't do anything. <laughs> There's a surprise. But anyway, we've got sheep milling around. And let's see how many that trailer can actually hold of sheep. 24. So yeah, we're going to be here a while. We are going to be here a while. I think you can buy sheep without transporting them, so we probably end up doing that in the end. I think it'll be much, much quicker. So until next time, I hope you guys have enjoyed. We'll be back tomorrow on either Ravenport or Fallsburn it depends what I record on Monday ideally I want to do Fallsburn because it's been a while since I've been on that map it feels but we'll see until next time hope you guys enjoyed catch you guys on the next one later